We are here today with the mayor to oversight what we know is work in progress. We are doing two oversight sites here in, um, in Royval as well as in the Clip Drift. I must say I'm very much happy on the progress that has been made up to this far here. You know that uh, this is one of the big uh, uh, wastewater treatment plant where affluent is discharged here uh, from uh, uh, Tswane. On the capacity of 120, they, they receive about 160 uh, to 164 at times. But uh, the work that has been done, deep ex excavation that is, is, is happening now here, they are on course. We are very much happy. The resources that have been put uh, by municipality in ensuring that uh, we complete this project, whilst the project has been delayed, but we are confident that uh, they are going to complete the project. It's a pleasure, Minister, to announce today that actually, um, in addition to completing Phase 1A, we have been able to start Phase 1B six months ahead of schedule. And while we are a slightly delayed because of the reasons that you have um, outlined that we're supposed to be at 10% on 1B, we are at 6% because of the inclement weather. So the project is going fairly well. Now, the other thing that is quite important that while we talk about the provision of clean water, there are also environmental issues that we are dealing with here. So we are able now to start uh, measuring the quality of effluent that's being discharged from um, the plant. And I think that's quite uh, important for us because it's not only the Hamaskral water, um, you know, Hamaskral community that's affected with issues of access to water. We've got farmers here in Royval that um, depended on this plant to provide clean water. We are continuing to implement the court order that they have in terms of making sure that they receive clean water through water tankers. But what is important is that they must also know that the quality of effluent that's being discharged from the plant is starting to improve. So those are key milestones um, that we have, Minister, and we continue to, um, you know, to progress and monitor the project and how we're implementing it. What is next now? We do have budget that is committed for this project. We have spent 350 million out of the 40, 450 million that's allocated by council, and the envisaged deadline for this project to be completed is June 2026.